Hi everyone, welcome to Geeks for Geeks. In this video, I will discuss more about Python, that is method overloading. Method overloading is a situation where two or more functions can have the same name but different parameters. Unlike other languages like C++, Java, etc., Python doesn't support method overloading. We may overload the methods but can only use the latest defined method. Let's see an example. So let's move to the geeks for geeks IDE. Here in this code, we have two defined methods of same name that is product. First one takes two parameters, second one takes three parameters. Here we are calling one of the method having two parameters means this should call this function which prints product of the two numbers. So let's run this code and check what is the output. Here as you can see there is an error in this case as we have defined another method having three parameters just after the first method we can so let's make this comment and try to call another method so now let's run this code so from this output we can now conclude that we may define many method of same name and different argument but we can only use the latest defined method however we may use other implementation in python to make the same function work differently and that is as per the arguments let's clear with an example we have defined only one method having data type and multiple arguments inside the function we have if condition having data type is equal to int then answer will be zero if the data type is equal to string str, our answer should be this. Then we have for loop. Inside the for loop, if argument is of int type, then we add the numbers. Otherwise, if we have a string type, then we add string by string. And finally, we print the answer. So let's run this code and see the output. So this code successfully runs as we have two arguments of int type in our first call which first prints the sum of the two numbers and after the second call we have string type of two arguments which string by string. So this is the end of this tutorial. Thank you for watching. Please leave us your likes and comments in the comment section.